Greetings and salutations. Welcome back to this let's play of Sid Meier's Civilization 3, and I'm Keb. Um, let's see, I'm still waiting for demographics. There must be a button for it somewhere. Don't know where. Maybe it takes a while for it to show up. Um, but yeah, we are gonna try to, to war longer with the Vikings. See how that pans out. There are Patriot tribes. Okay, so there are more natives for us to enslave, unfortunately. We are stronger than the, the Sumerians, that's good. What about the Vikings? Strong military, that's what I want to hear. I'm not sure, quite sure how it counts it, but probably an amount, in amounts of pips and stuff. Uh, tempted to move this guy back to deal with the Barbarian. Oh, see there, oh, oh, he's trying to expand, I don't want that. We produced a javelin thrower, very good. Soon to Palenque, you're not going to produce a javelin thrower, you're going to produce a settler. Or, to put it in another way, you're going to try to produce a settler. And that's going to take a long, long time. Start moving units. Javelin thrower in two turns. It's going to take two turns to get here. If he is planning to attack, he's going to attack anyway. Nah. In that case, I need this guy near the attack force. So, he's probably gonna plant a city right here. That is probably what he's gonna do. And that is bad news for me. And him settling Kish there, that's also rather unpleasant. Yeah, he has taken this entire area. That can't stand. We'll probably need a lot more units for him because he has a greater defensive value. Let's wait and see what happens. Barbarians moving in on Sumeria, which I'm fine with. Yeah, he built a town there. Uh, it was quite expected. Uh, wait with that one. I'm gonna. Give it some thought. I can't build a mine on floodplains. Okay, uh, build an irrigation there then. And you're still just moving slowly around the corner there. Still haven't found anyone in the south here, which is good. Hmm. Uh, this guy's a regular. Can he take down a warrior in a city on his own? Probably not. Huh. Let's see. Let's talk to Lord Brock. Can you propose a deal? You have the wheel and iron working. Uh, would you get offering something for ceremonial burial? No. Uh, what would you want for iron working? You'd want ceremonial burial and masonry. Never mind, I'm not really keen on giving him that. What about Sumeria? You have iron working as well. But you already know the text we'd know. Oh, darn it, we're actually behind Sumeria. Um, are we going to get tech for ticking cities? I don't know. Let's find out. Yeah, we have to do this. Uh, I said do it! Please win this battle, please. Yes! No! Yes! Woohoo! And we entered a golden age! Destroyed Copenhagen and liberated some gold. Yeah, lovely. And now we're gonna just move down to Trondheim, and he's gonna be royally pissed. And we have a golden age. Which I do not recall what does in this game. Let's just check if there is a... Oh, that's the full entry. Uh, G. That's this, but this letter. Golden Age. It gives us what? Producing one extra shield and or commerce. If it's already producing one. Um... Interesting. So now we're supposed to build a lot faster. 
for how long? Ah, me and reading. How, how many turns? Yeah, each civil is a unique military unit. When this is victorious in battle and only with other civs. Yeah, that's fine. So we're generating a golden age thanks to our warmongering. Okay, well, it's definitely the right, the right choice then. We destroyed one of his towns. We got nothing out of it, unfortunately, other than a slight upgrade. We are producing... Yeah, that's the problem. <laughs> yeah, they're producing one more shield, all right. But, the, but since we're a despotism, uh, <laughs> that pans out to nothing. So, yeah, uh, we're going to get nothing from our hometown there. We are going to get a few more shields here. Right. No? Maybe. <laughs> okay, so we're in a golden age, but because of the despotism, we're getting pretty darn nothing out of it. Yeah. That is kind of sad. That's all jungle. Uh. <laughs> okay, we're in a golden age, which does not... Yeah, okay doesn't give us anything at all, really. That's kind of sad. He's probably gonna attack the city, which is kind of dumb. Or not. Okay, yeah, we, yeah build the pyramids, that's fine, you need to start. Jalen throw there, he's gonna train against the barbarian. Give me worker, please. Uh, you promoted the veteran, but no worker. We need to get these guys up into the main battle. He's gonna rest. How does this work again? Can we heal him up outside our own territory? I don't recall. Let's go there, even though there are barbarians there. Okay, so that's coastal. That means he's gonna have to spread our way. And that's not good. I'm very surprised. And maybe this is the entire continent. In which case, I think I do want to have a clash of civilizations with our other friend here, too. Because then we'd have our entire continent for ourselves. But we don't technically need it. Yeah, it does heal, I think. Come down, I want a few units. I want at least three units attacking. And you finished that. You are damaged, though. But still, move up and heal up there. We need to explore this area. These barbarians are, are slowing him down, and I'm fine with that. Can move away from them, even if he's gonna tell us to get lost. Uh, some good yachts, we have to take it. Oh my goodness! Free iron working. That is glorious. That is really glorious. Uh, now for the big question Do we have iron anywhere? Iron. There's all the way up here. What about our friend down here? Does he have iron? He. Th there's iron outside Bergen. I don't know if there's anything south of him. And this seems to be actually a cordon of area. Very good. We need to explore this first. I need to find out if there's a land bridge here. Very good. Yeah, we need to start spreading like crazy. Copan is just going to build settlers now. Um, let's see, now we only have one military unit in each of these. That's okay, the next city will probably have to be on the far side on the mountains here. Just to curb him while we kill our other neighbor. I don't know, a city on this side. And we compete over this. Now it depends on what we find up there. Good, we've built a settler, that's fine. Um, it's gonna take how many turns to grow? Three turns? That's pretty, pretty fast. I mean, we could get the spearman out and just to increase our defenses, then we could escort the 
Ah, yeah, we probably do need a spearman before we build a stone settler. We need an escort. Can't go everywhere unescorted. Everything here is okay, really. Uh, the road up here is probably more important than anything else right now. And you are definitely gonna go in this direction. Those units are healed. Start moving down on Tron time. We probably want to hit Tron time first. Uh, yeah, we need to go north first. We have quite a few of these units. Hopefully that'll be enough to take Tron time. And Vergen. Kind of depends. Oh, he moved on in on us. Um, yeah, okay, what's the big picture? Do we want to keep pushing for literature? That is the big question. Yeah, we probably do want to push for literature, even now. Um, right, wait a second. Uh, we... the courthouse. Decreases corruption. That could be very useful over in Trondheim if we capture it. Yeah, you know what? Let's go court laws. Uh, let's establish embassies. Yeah, sure, let's do that. Uh, build an embassy with Sumeria. Oh, he's building a wonder. He's building a wonder. What does the oracle do again? That doubles the effect of temples, I think. Uh, we are at war with them, so we can't really do anything there. Um, can we do espionage? No. Too expensive. Uh, cancel. Or just, okay, that's fine too. He's building the oracle, and the oracle does what exactly? I think it doubles the uh, temples. Is that right? The oracle. Doubles effect of temples. Uh, two content phases into one. Tourist attraction, golden age for religious civs. And obsolete. Yeah, I don't think... That's actually okay. Let him build that. Because that means he's not building settlers or anything useful. And it also means we can conquer it. 50 turns. Yeah, that seems like the time it's gonna take us to do all the stuff we need to do. This warrior is in defensible terrain. Yeah, go for it. Don't die, don't die. Yay, and we got a free worker. And we got a free worker, and that worker is gonna go home. And I just wanted to settle here so we can deny him some territory. And we probably want to settle down here somewhere. This terrain isn't exactly ideal for us. The game there, maybe. There's a the river here. That's not terribly bad. I don't know if we need a canal here. I honestly don't know. Um, Palenque. Can, can Palenque build ships? It cannot. Okay, so this is considered an inland lake. So we can't build naval units and ship them out. Okay. Because you are connected there. Yeah. So building a canal is worthless. Okay. Um, so probably there we want a city then. Probably. For now though, our focus is on conquering Trondheim. And we are bringing in quite a few units. Though it takes us forever to get there. Oh, civil disorder, darn it. Um, wait a second, why are you unhappy? You have a garrison? Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna cut that, I guess, and see if that straightens things out. I guess it's war weariness. Yeah, that's of course it. Of course we're at war. That makes our people unhappy. 
and we'll slowly you're gonna study there and heal. Check there. I'm pretty certain this is gonna be yeah, it looks like this is gonna be an open area. Spearman, yeah, that's what we wanted to build. What did he just send out there? What did he just send out? I need to explore that. Was that a worker? Did he send a worker out in the open? That, that's an archer. Okay, um... Yeah, it's in defensive terrain, but just two at uh, one defense. Uh, we're gonna take the chances. Yay, yeah. yeah, hey! Succeeded again. And now he has a spearman defending. Yeah, that's to be expected, I guess. And start moving in on Trondheim. Goody hot, pop it. We got the wheel. Not the free tech. I like this. I like getting free techs. Oh my goodness, what did I just see down there? That's a lot of gems. That is a lot of gems. Uh, it's gonna take a while to get there though. Yeah, we need to probably need to settle it there. I think that's gonna be the best choice for us. I'm gonna get some gold. That's gonna be pretty good when we mine it. Getting some good food, yeah, th yeah. That seems like the good choice. So Trondheim, with your game, get your game on. Can you have fish and incense? Yeah, we need to push and say hi. Hopefully, before he makes city walls. And did he just send a settler there? He did. Yeah. Okay. Fortify this one for now. Uh, javelin throw. You are going to heal up. Oh, darn it. That means he's beelining here, I guess. Let's see if we can ruin his day. And block him a little bit. Delay him. Um... We're gonna take our chances and move this one there. Uh, move that one back. Ah. You can't heal in foreign territory, can you? It's gonna take a while to get critical mass here. Yeah, so he definitely can't go this way. He is spreading like wildfire. And we need to do the same. Um, let's see now. Palenque cannot do this. No, I can't. Cannot do this. I can't hurry production because that would empty the city. Yeah, never mind. Um, let's see now. It would cost one citizen its life to get all the shields. Uh, but it would take two pops to make the settler. What happens? Do they move out of the city completely or do they... Uh, either they, either the city becomes completely abandoned or they just have to wait until the city grows. Which is rather annoying. Or... I don't think that's anything to gain from that. But, oh my goodness, I played for part long again. I'm gonna need to take a break. Don't I? Uh, oh no, I don't. Um, new glasses. Ah. Oh, my timer was wrong. I saw that 10 minutes wrong. Do. Um, yeah, new glasses time, apparently. Uh, no, I don't want to risk it. Let's just wait 9 turns. That's when this is gonna finish. That one's gonna be in 5 turns. Everything's gonna be glorious. We're gonna kill the... Our other neighbors as well, as soon as we finish with the Vikings, hopefully. He moved another archer out. Okay, that pushed him that tons further south, and he's sending a big raiding party this way. 
I am not happy about that. Let's move further back. And connect with this one. We might have to deal with all those barbarians. Let's move this way. Barbarian hordes. I don't like that. He's trying to heal up. He's gonna have to attack. Please increase to... Yeah, you gotta work her out of that. Lovely. I probably want to keep him near Trondheim, just in case. I would love to attack you. I really would. Oh my! I never thought this was just a flat coastline there, but my goodness. We're gonna have to attack him if he's gonna spread this far this way. I only have one unit still. I need more units. I need at least three units on that front. And he's trying to attack me. Let's move away. Is that a warrior? It is a warrior. Regular warrior. Uh, go out there. Heal a little bit. You're gonna heal. You're gonna stay. You're gonna defend the stack. You're sitting on top of the volcano, okay. Move a bit closer, and you finished the road. Keep building the road. And we're going to see if we can settle a town right there. Not ideal, but I want it. And you moved here. Okay. If that disallows my city, I'm going to be unhappy. I don't think it does. Are we losing to Geraldton or are we gaining? We're losing two turns. And you're stacking up an army and you put this in there. You bastard. Uh, fortify and build a town there. Yeah, uh, Spearman, that's fine. Yeah, I want you to be defensive. And that is probably not a good idea. But I can't have all these barbarians right next to me. That worked better than I thought. A lot better. Uh, more javelin throwers are inbound. Okay, so now he has... An archer, a warrior. Unfortunately, he did spent... Uh, he rush bot in Trondheim. So Trondheim will be destroyed if I attack. Do I want him to attack me or do I want to wait and see if he fortifies? Uh, no, we have to take our chances here. Oh darn it. That went really badly. Ah. We have to keep trying. Come on. Okay, that one died. Uh, we can't do anything with the worker, of course. Another javelin throw. He's damaged. Uh, keep pushing. Keep the worker there. Okay. And he probably made another unit. Go out there, try to heal. The rest of you need to move in. Now. You stay. Let's just check. Is there anything good there? No, there is not anything good there. <sighs> Keep pushing here. And we got a new worker for it. Good. He can go and try to help up the new town. Yeah, I really don't want him to have this. That's just not gonna happen. 
So we're gonna have to fight Sumeria at some point. The problem is that they have the perfect counter unit to us. More or less. And that is very, very annoying. Chechnitsa now has five people. One of which is an entertainer to keep things going. I probably... Wait a second, that's a horse. Isn't it? Okay, so we do have horses. That's good. Would have been better to have iron in the hills here, but... I'm gonna build a mine after this. Hopefully, Caban is building another settler. Um, yeah, where do we want to go with that? Probably down here, just to see if we can connect our empire eventually. Because I think we're gonna take a Trondheim. Capture it. Let's just go through the menu a second. Let's see, we have the domestic stops. All content people mostly, building settlers. That's the trade, we don't really have anything. But at the moment, we have... Compared to the, yeah, we still have strong to compare to them, I certainly hope so, and... Same thing with Sumeria. Captured units, barbarians, and one Viking. The Vikings are furious with us. Yeah, I don't really hope so. Uh, just, do you, you have new techs for us? What's the deal? Actually, you don't. We have more techs than you now. Never mind. Uh, cultural. Doing okay, I guess. Techs. And we know that they're building, I wonder. Uh, okay, victory vice. 18% of the world's population, and of course Sumeria is ahead of us. Sumeria is a rather nasty save to contend with early on. Could be worse. Could always be worse. And it's not like we're short of space. Not really. So I suppose we could wait. The disadvantage is that we have our javelin throwers right now. But again... They have the Enkidu Warriors, so they get very cheap, very effective defensive units. And he's building a wonder for us. He is building the Oracle for us. Um, I think I want to build a temple here. While the city grows. Temple and then a settler after that. Maybe not, you will actually grow... Faster. Nah, get the happiness from the temple. I kind of want that. And that means you have a settler, and the settler was supposed to go. Let's see now. Uh, we could place a city here, which would be rather aggressive of us. There's no other way to get the fish, really. And the iron is there, which is rather nice, but. It is beyond his. Actually, yeah, it is beyond his borders. So he'll probably settle there. Or somewhere near here. If we want the fish, we'd have to settle here-ish. Which would be rather bad. I mean, the fish isn't that valuable. <sighs> it wouldn't be quite as aggressive in terms of terrain. I don't think the canal... Do I want to build a city that close, though? Uh, we would just have jungle ties, right? That would just be a lot of jungle. Out here, at least, you have grasslands. Not exactly ideal, either. Eleven turns to get there. And get moving. And take... You know what? Take the spearmen with you. Yeah, take the spearman with you, because the warrior is uh, less important, really. Okay, worker here. You can go here. We need to build the road. Connect all our units. And he's trying to get our worker. 
No deal, my friend. <laughs> Another free worker. Lovely. Um, go up here. We're going to need to improve these squares down there and try to make Tikal grow faster. We also need to find out just how much space our friend there has. Suspect he has quite a lot. And one turn to get there, so let's start. Next turn we'll have three units capable of attacking, and we probably have to do that. Uh, but before then, we probably should take a short break. Yeah. Now my eyes are correct, I think. <laughs> so, yeah. Short break. Thank you for watching.